employees that any airline has ever seen work here. Mr. Hagedorn and Miss Seelig have been working here for over 30 years. 30 years, eh? Miss Seelig is responsible for new applicants. She sorts them into pilots, flight attendants, and advisors. Click on Miss Seelig once to talk to her and ask her about new applications. She doesn't hear too good anymore, so speak loud and clearly. Okay. Hello, boss. What can I do for you? You saying old. I need... I have to say that this is really uh, cozy here. I need new employees. I need capable... Uh, hello, boss. <laughs> Just click on an employee from the list. And an info window will open right up. You used to have to laboriously study the resumes by hand. Today, the computer does all of that. Okay. What am I doing? Um, flight attendants and pilot. Okay. Then it spits out the skill level and salary requirements for every applicant. <laughs> Therefore, you can see how much money the new employee will cost and, and how qualified he is before you hire him. Okay, to we'll man it. your airplane, you now need one pilot yep. and two flight attendants. That pilot looks drunk or stoned. Right, higher, higher, and higher. Very good. Yeah. Now that you have a couple new employees, you should speak with Mr. Hagedorn. He takes care of the management of the employees. Tell him that you would like to review your staff assignments. Right, okay. Um. Ah, oh, hello, boss. Hello, mate. Um, I'd like to review assignments. <laughs> the toy keeps going to the airport dance club this week. We can. Yeah. Oh! That's kind of an inconvenient time for me, boss. As I unfortunately already have an appointment with my cat. <laughs> right, oh. Okay. Hello, boss. Hello, mate. Uh, I'd like. Boss, if you haven't assigned the minimum crew to a machine, then it won't be able to start. If you don't want to constantly keep an eye on everything yourself, I recommend that you hire a personnel advisor. Okay. Sounds like a plan. This is what the distribution of your employees, okay? You'll see a list with all your airplanes on the left side, oh, and what? your staff is listed on the right side. Yep. To assign an employee to an airplane, yep. you first need to select the machine, and then the employee, and then click on assign. Click on the assign. Okay. Um, okay. As soon as you have hired an employee, you can pull up substantially more information about him. Employees are demanding. Their motivation will decrease, for example, if they receive less salary than they would like. Actually, they should be glad that they have work at all, if you ask me, boss. Yeah, we're in a recession. They should be happy with the job. If you drop in again later, we can talk more extensively about the salaries of the staff. To start with, you should give some more thought to the salary of a particular main assistant chief consulting analyst. <laughs> That's like uh -huh, uh, Mr. Uh, Hagedorn, I believe that one of your pencils isn't exactly parallel to the others. Uh, you should take care of that. Uh, now we will quickly go to the office of the airplane manager. Uh, we have an urgent appointment there. Right, okay, we better go. Are you finished, boss? Yes. Yes, I am. Let's, uh, let's go. What a funny guy, that Hagedorn, <laughs> isn't he? Uh, so right this way. <laughs> Stop lynching. Mr. Usaroni is the new airport manager. He's the person you should have the most respect for here. He can take the air out of your airline sails faster than you can say Urig. But now, in with you and tell him that you would like to manage your routes. Oh, going in there, am I? Okay. We're gonna go see the main man. 
the airport manager. I own it, but I guess he's the manager. He's I see. Managing it. So you're one of the new tycoons? Hmm. I give out the licenses for flight routes here. No license, no flight on the route. By the way, I only give out additional licenses for new routes if you are using the adjacent routes to full capacity. Since you're still an unmade man, you only have one round trip route to choose from at first. All right, let's get it over with and talk business. Just click on the flashing lease route button after you've asked me about your routes. <laughs> okay. Never ask me about my business, but I can tell you about your business. I'd like. I'd like to manage, my, like routes. To manage my routes. Oh, cool. Frankfurt to London. London to Frankfurt. Since you're an enemy man, I can only choose that one. London, Frankfurt, I'm back again. I'd like to lease that right, please. There we go. Well, he's not exactly friendly, but despite any unfriendliness, he's always fair. Now head to my, uh, your office and <laughs> click on the global map on the wall to get to flight planning. What are you doing? Stop lunging. Okay. Oh, cool. You know, in 9 out of 10 cases, it's a razor, but but every once in a while, it's a... Hmm? Yes? <laughs> what? Okay. I'm busy. Okay. You're weird. So go to my office, which I think's in... Oh, no, no, no. That's it up there. Let's go to my office. And look at my wall, apparently. Oh god, he really likes lunging. He's even got a picture of himself lunging. Right, you have rented the route from London to Frankfurt. Now, how do I... Shove it. Okay. He's playing with his tank. Airport guide not purchased. Objective. Enter world map. Uh, I don't think this guy's got a world map. What's that? Am I missing something? Am I being really silly? Am I missing something here? The world... Ah! Bloody... Donut. There's a big globe. Okay. Flight planning is one of your most important tasks, tasks and should not be neglected. Or to put it another way, the better your flight planning, the more moolah you'll make. Hell yeah! We're all about the moolah. Now, let's take a closer look at your chartered route. When you click on your route, two tabs become available to you. The tab, Statistics, is activated by default. There you'll find all kinds of worthwhile information about this route. But even more interesting is the tab, Prices. Okay. Okay. Um, what, what do I do? At the beginning, the normal price is always preset. But in order to be sure that enough passengers really come, let's set the price to dumping for now. To do so, click on the button next to Dumping Price. There's an old principle. The cheaper the tickets, the more passengers. Dumping the price. We're going to be dumping... We're going to dump the price. Um, where's the... Dumping the price thing? I want to dump the price. Hide maintenance, display all routes. Oh, I got it. Dump in the price. Frankfurt. 
Now that we've set the prices, we also want to carry out the flight. To do so, select your airplane from the list. The flight plan is only in effect for the selected machine. Okay. Keep in mind that your new airplane is here in London, so select the route London to Frankfurt. To schedule the flight for the next available alternatively, you can also use the mouse to drag flights directly from the list to the flight plan. Okay. London to Frankfurt. So then we want to go Frankfurt to London. Can you just keep repeating this? So what's that? That's London to Frankfurt. And then it's Frankfurt. Oh god, I paused this up already. Um, delete. 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 Right, okay, we've got one. This light is locked and cannot be delayed or delete. Okay. Okay. Next. By the way, a flight always needs a certain amount of time before it can start. Therefore, you can indeed set it to the current time, but it will then be automatically move to the back. Okay. Let's head to the public airport area now to your airline's check-in counters to observe how the passengers go there and check into their flight. We can get there by exiting the world map and using the elevator in the business area. Right, okay, cool. Um, so I've got one flight. Is that all i got? Is a uh, white time stick in? Okay, let's go. That's not going to make me much money, is it? Just to do one flight there. I needed to repeat that a few times, but I'm sure they let me know. Now you can watch the passengers or explore the airport. I'm going to take a little break now and let you know when it's time to move on. Okay. If it's taking too long for you, you can also speed up the game with the buttons below. Oh, can I spin this right? Camera? No. Oh, this is my airport. So where's the passengers coming in? Mugabe. Ah, oh, this is us. Ah, right. Bum, bum, bum. Ha, <laughs> look at that dude. These guys have to come up there, don't they? Yeah. Okay. Well, I hope you've uh, enjoyed it so far. Uh, I'll probably end the video here. Uh, thank you for watching. This is Stocker Gloss and Airplane. What is it? Airplane Simulator 2. I'm not quite sure. <laughs> I've forgotten what it's called. But anyway, um, this is Stocker Gloss and uh, thank you for watching. I'll uh, I'll see you all again. Ciao for now.